Welcome back, everybody, and this one should be a dandy this afternoon. And it is perfect football weather here for today's matchup between the UCLA Bruins and the Grambling State Tigers. And here come the Tigers. Brad Nessler, Lee Corso, and Kirk Herbstreet here ready and excited to bring you what appears to be another great gridiron matchup. The Bruins come out like they're just going to roll over this team. What do you think about that, Herbie? Yeah, unfortunately, this one won't be much of a contest. Brambling State has spent all week trying to figure out how they're going to slow this running back down. Well, Lee, in my opinion, they could have spent all year. It still won't matter. He's going to have a big day and a big win. You're 100% correct. Rambling State is not going to be able to slow down this rushing attack, and I'm going to tell you why. That defensive line is going to get dominated up front, Kirk, and they're going to lose this one big. Thanks, guys. Let's head down to the field. The two teams are lined up for the coin toss. Grambling State has lined up for the kickoff, and we're ready to get this one underway. Here's the kick. Number 29 fields it at the 9. take over at the 29-yard line. Number 10 with four wide receivers. And they make the stop at the 38. Gain of nine. Second and one, ball on the 38. Grambling State brings in the nickel here. Number 10 drops to throw. He unloads it. He's hit and got away. They'll bring him down at the 40-yard line. He looks to be hurt down there. First and ten, ball on the 40-yard line. UCLA sets up in the eye. Brought down at the 41. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. It's second down and nine to go. Ball on the 41. Ace backfield. Number 46 brings him down at the 43-yard line. Couple of yards there. It's third down and seven to go. This is the fifth play of this drive. The Bruins line up with three wide. Drops back to pass. Looks. And he's got all the time in the world. Rifles it right side. Complete. Sheds that one. Wow, how about that third down conversion? Boy, what a play here, guys. I'm really impressed with the poise of this young quarterback. He was very cool and collected out there on that third and long play. It's first and ten. Ball on the 44. The Bruins with four receivers. He drops back. Looking. He lets it go. Swatted away. 
The corner almost came up with a big turnover there. Well, the corner's able to bat this ball away, but he'd love another opportunity there to make the catch. They're not going to like to hear me say this, but that's one of the reasons why they're on defense and not playing offense. So it's second and ten. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Four-man front by the defense. Under pressure, he passes it. It falls incomplete. He was way out in front on that one. Yeah, there was no chance for the tight end to catch up to that ball there. Third and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive. Number 27 lines up as a single back. Number 10 back to pass. He's looking for his man, and it's caught. And down he goes at the 30. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. It's first and ten. Ninth play of this drive coming up. The Tigers come out in a 34 defense. Back to pass. He's looking. Throws it out there. Picks it off. Great catch by the linebacker, but not a smart throw from the quarterback. It didn't look like the quarterback even saw the linebacker hanging in that area. It pays to be in the right spot at the right time. First and ten. Ball on the 27. Ace backfield. Number 10 gives it up the middle. Juku. And he's tackled at the 35. A nice pickup of about eight yards. Second and two, ball on their own 35. Defense lines up, eight men in the box. Number 10 gives it up the middle. Number 44 with a takedown at the 38. And it looks like there's an injury down there on the field. He's holding on to his leg there, guys. I sure hope he's okay. First and ten, ball on their own 38. UCLA comes out in a 4-3. Number 45 takes a handoff. They'll bring him down at the 38. Didn't get anything. And second down and 10 to go. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Number 33, alone in the backfield. Drops back to pass. He throws it to the 40. And they finally tackle him at the 33-yard line. And the wideout gets a chance to show what he can do. Oh, he sure does. And he doesn't disappoint either. Great athletic ability. It's first and ten. Ball on the 33. They line up in an eye. They'll run the option. Lateral back. Number 24 tackles him for a loss on the play. Here the tailback had really nowhere to go. The defense does a good job of getting penetration, and they were able to wrap him up for a loss. Second down, 15 to go. Seventh play of this drive coming up. They come out with three wide receivers. And that's the end of the quarter. We're scoreless after one. Now the teams have switched sides, and we're ready for the start of the second quarter. Second and 15, ball on the 38. The Tigers have five receivers on this play. He drops back. Let's it fly. Complete. Brought down at the 27. The wide receiver picks up good yardage that time.
Third and four. Eighth play of this drive coming up. The Tigers line up in an I formation. He's at the 20. Number 17 brings him down at the 15. And that was an excellent run there. Yeah, that was great blocking, Brad, up front by the offensive line to open up that hole. It's first and ten. Ninth play of this drive coming up. UCLA lines up defensively in a 3-4. Back to pass. He fires left side. And they push him out at the 10-yard line. Hey, what a great catch. Yeah, he was aware of where the sideline was and made sure he stayed in bounds when he caught the ball. The Bruins line up in a 3-4. Number 10 drops back to pass. Let's it go. Makes a catch in the end zone. Touchdown. That was quite a play as he found his wide receiver for the touchdown. And he hits the PAT. Over four minutes remain in the second quarter, and our score is Grambling, seven, UCLA, nothing. Grambling State is ready to kick it away. Kicks it off. Flag on the play. Kicks it off. Illegal procedure on the kicking team. The ball will be spotted at the 35-yard line. First down. They'll get the ball here at the 35-yard line. The Tigers come out in a 34 defense. A little handoff. They'll bring him down at the 43-yard line. About eight yards there. Second and two coming up here. Ball on the 43. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. Number 10 gives it up the middle. Spins up field. Number 58 with a takedown at the 46. First down pick up by the tailback. You can see how comfortable this guy is with that football in his arms. It's first and 10, ball on the 46-yard line. UCLA lines up in a double tight set. Number 10 steps back to pass. He unloads it, and it's gone. Gets past the tackler. Number 57 brings him down at the 46. They pick up good yardage that time on the pass play. Here they kind of put pressure on the quarterback and challenged him to find the hole in the defense. And in this case, he did. Nice job. Second and two coming up here. Ball on the 46. Number 27 lines up as a single back. He's hit and got away. Spin move. Number 58 with a takedown at the 40. A nice six-yard gain by the tailback there. First and 10. Ball on the 40. The Tigers put four men up front. Number 10 drops back, rolls right. He lets it go. Number 47 drops it. Number 
Second and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. 4-3 defense. They hand it off. And he's taken down at the 36-yard line. That's four yards on the play. Third and six. Seventh play of this drive coming up. UCLA comes out with an eye formation. Number 10 gives it up the middle, and they make the stop at the 33. Well, they try to keep it on the ground for the first down. You know, Brad, here the defense just steps up and makes a play, stopping them and bringing up fourth down. It's fourth down and three yards to go. They're in field goal range. The Bruins line up with three wide. Drops back to pass. He guns it to the right. Complete. And down he goes at the 17-yard line. The Bruins are going to take a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. Here's another look at that pass, Kirk. Boy, Brad, what a great throw by the quarterback. I mean, this guy doesn't mess around. He sees his target wide open, gets him the ball quickly. Look at the velocity on that throw. It's first and ten. Ninth play of this drive coming up. Four-man front by the defense. handoff he's inside the 10 and they'll score and a nice job by the running back that was one heck of a touchdown let's look at that touchdown one more time And he tacks on the extra point. So with just over a minute to go in the half, the score, UCLA, 7, Grambling, 7. UCLA to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. Number 33 fields it in the end zone. They'll start this drive at the 18. Grambling State lines up in a shotgun set. He passes it, and it's caught. Number 11 brings him down for a loss. Grambling State calls a timeout, and they've got two remaining. Second down, 14 coming up here. Ball on their own 14. Grambling State lines up with three receivers. Number 10 drops to throw. He's looking for his man. Number 9 brings him down at the 28. A nice pass play there. Let me tell you, the reason why this play worked was the fact that the defense didn't do a good job of knocking the wide receiver off his route. You got to jam him at the line and throw their timing off. He drops back. Looks, throws it out there. Incomplete. Almost a nice catch. This is a missed opportunity here. The receiver got his hands on the ball, but couldn't quite pull it in. Right. 
Second and ten. Ball on the 28-yard line. Number 10 with three wide receivers. Number 10 gives it up the middle. Number 98 with a takedown at the 28. UCLA takes a timeout. That was their second timeout. It's third down and 10. Ball on their own 28. Grambling State lines up in a goal line set. Number 40 gets it on the inside. They'll bring him down at the 29-yard line. The Bruins call for a timeout, and that was their third and final timeout. It's fourth down, nine yards to go. Ball on the 29-yard line. The Tigers are lining up to punt it away. Didn't get all of that one. Number nine fields at the 44. Inside the 30. What a great return. A few things here, guys. Poor coverage by the punting team and a great job by the returner of turning the ball upfield. He didn't have to do too much. That coverage was horrendous. They'll go to work at the 21. The Tigers come out in a 34 defense. Back to pass. He throws it. Number 18 has it. Number 19 brings him down at the nine. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here. And again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Drop back to pass. Under heavy pressure. Complete. And he stopped behind the line. And they hurry up to the line. You're right. Sometimes you can catch the defense napping a little bit. And we'll go into halftime here with a score all deadlocked. UCLA will be kicking off to start the second half. We should have a return on this one. Number five takes it from the six. They'll take over at the 27. The defense will stack the line of scrimmage. On the ground, up the middle. Number 22 with a takedown at the 32-yard line. A pickup of five. Second and five coming up here. Ball on their own 32. Number 10 has five receivers lined up here. He drops back. And that one's fallen incomplete. And there was a lot of pressure on the quarterback there. Yeah, he had to get rid of him in a hurry, and that's why his pass was off. It's third down and five to go. Ball on their own 32. They come out with three wide receivers. Number 10, back to throw. Let's it fly. Number 40 with a catch. And he's tackled at the 33. He didn't get the first down. Hey, fantastic job by the defense there by not allowing to get any yards after the catch. Fourth and four coming up on this play. Ball on the 33-yard line. Grambling State lining up the punt. Number nine takes it to 36. So he managed to get a few yards on the run back. Yeah, but I'll tell you, Brad, with so much traffic in the middle there, it really makes it tough to break free. Right. 
They'll get the ball here at the 40-yard line. Number 10 comes to the line with three wide. Number 10, back to pass. Let's it go. And it's caught. He can provide some excitement. He sure can. And the thing that makes this play successful is the fact that he's on the same page with his quarterback. Sometimes you see wide receivers that don't have their heads in the game, and they make stupid mistakes. You're right. Then they complain about not getting the ball. First and 10, ball on the 29-yard line. The Bruins with four receivers. Number 10 steps back to pass. Penalty marker on the field. Looking. Plenty of time in the pocket. Guns it across the middle. Number one makes a catch inside the 10. Number 19 brings him down at the four. Holding. Holding. On the offense. On the offense. Ten yard Ten penalty. penalty. Still first down. down. It's first and a mile. Ball on the 39-yard line. Nickel defense. Play action. He unloads it. Complete inside the 20. Touchdown, Bruins. They made a great connection there for the touchdown, didn't they, fellas? What a quarterback threw a strike to the wide receiver. He caught it and took it all away. Well, what a dangerous combination. You can't say enough about how good that throw was. The quarterback put that one right on the money. And he hits the PAT. So under three minutes to go in the third quarter. And the score, UCLA 14, Grambling 7. UCLA ready to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number five, fields it at the one. He spins, fumbles the ball, and they fall on the loose ball. They'll start this drive at the 17. Grambling State comes out with two tight ends. Number 10 still has it. He rifles it to the left. Number 17 with a takedown at the 44-yard line. And the wideout gets a chance to show what he can do. Oh, he sure does. And he doesn't disappoint either. Great athletic ability. It's first and 10. Ball on the 44. Grambling State comes out with five receivers. Back to pass. He fires right. Number 82 hangs on to it. Number 22 brings him down at the 42-yard line. The wide receiver picks up good yardage that time. First and 10, ball on the 42. Number 33 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. It's the ball. No, they faked it. He lets it go, and it's caught. Number 22 with a takedown at the 24. A good pickup on the play action pass. It's first and 10, ball on the 24. 
UCLA comes out in a 3-4. He steps up. It's intercepted. Oh, he got nailed on that one. What a catch. I'm surprised he was able to hang on to that one. You know, sometimes you hear people say that defensive backs can't catch the ball very good. That's why they play defensive back instead of receiver. Well, this guy just proved that theory wrong. He can definitely catch the football. Yeah, there are some exceptions. I will definitely admit that. First and ten. Ball on their own 19. The Bruins line up in an eye formation. Number 74 brings him down at the 25. The fullback bangs it in there for a gain of six. It's second down and four to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. UCLA lines up with three receivers. There's the play fake. He passes it. Number 25 has it, and he's finally brought down at the 40. The wideout comes up with a spectacular play. Yeah, and if I'm the coach, I put a big circle around that play so I can remember to call that one again. Good call. It's first and 10, ball on the 40. The Bruins line up with three wide. Drop back to pass. He's looking. Good protection. He's looking for his man. And they couldn't hook up on that one. And the wideout is kicking himself after that effort. Second and 10, fifth play of this drive coming up. Number 10 with three wide receivers. Number 10 gives it up the middle. Nothing doing. Tackled for a loss on the play. And that play was snuffed out from the get-go. You're right. It's a delayed handoff to the tailback, and the defense wasn't fooled at all there. And that'll bring this quarter to an end. Folks, we've played three, and our score is UCLA 14, Grambling 7. And we're ready for the start of the fourth quarter. It's third down and 11 to go. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Number 27 lines up as a single back. Number 10 drops back to pass. Looks. Going deep. And it falls incomplete. Fourth down, 11, ball on the 41. The special teams coach sends his punt team out on the field. Number five, signals for a fair catch. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Go to work at the 20. Number 10 comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. Throws it out there. Swatted away. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 20. Grambling State comes to the line with three wide. Number 10 gives it up the middle. Number 42 brings him down for a loss. Two-yard loss. Third and 12 coming up on this one. Ball on their own 18. They'll bring in their dime package. Back to pass. 
Looking. He's scrambling. He throws it. Number five with a catch. Kirk, what do you have for us? Well, that catch put the receiver over 100 yards. He's been one of the quarterback's favorite targets all game long. First and ten. Ball on the 49. The Tigers have five receivers on this play. Number 10, back to throw. He's looking. He wants it all going long. And down he goes at the 21. He can provide some excitement. He sure can. And the thing that makes this play successful is the fact that he's on the same page with his quarterback. Sometimes you see wide receivers that don't have their heads in the game, and they make stupid mistakes. You're right. Then they complain about not getting the ball. It's first and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. Four-man front by the defense. Number ten gives it up the middle. Tackle at the 20. A gain of one. Drops back to pass. Let's it fly. Complete. Touchdown, Tigers. A great throw, and that's his second touchdown catch of the game. The quarterback knew exactly where to put the pass, and the receiver went out there and made the grab. Good communication there. That touchdown pass we're seeing again. Ah, you betcha. He runs a good clean route there, and the quarterback throws it to him with a lot of confidence. Good touchdown, guys. And he tacks on the extra point. So with just over three minutes remaining in the fourth quarter, the score is Grambling 14, UCLA 14. Grambling State lines up for the kickoff. Number six and number 29, back deep to return. Short kick, he didn't get a hold of that one. Number 29, fields it at the 11. He jukes it. They'll take over at the 34-yard line. The Bruins go with the I formation. Number 10, back to pass. Here comes the pressure, lets it go. And it's caught, and he's taken down at the 34. Here's another look. Number 10 drops back. He unloads it. Complete. Number 10 drops to throw. He lets it go. Incomplete. They got some good pressure on him there. Yeah, but don't forget the fact that nobody was open. That was good coverage, too. It's third down and three to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. The Tigers line up in a 3-4. They'll throw the flag. He's at the 20. Inside the 10. And he's tackled at the 7. Holding. Holding. On the offense. On the offense. Ten yard Ten yard penalty. Penalty. Still third down. Third down. Third down, 13. Ball on the 37-yard line. 
Grambling State lines up with five defensive backs. And they couldn't hook up on that one. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Hey, that kid went down hard, but he's a tough kid. He'll shrug it off. Fourth and 13, ball on the 37. The defense lines up with six DBs. He drops back. He passes it. Number one makes the catch. Number 19 with a takedown at the 18-yard line. First down, can you believe it? Brad, I can't. That was an incredible pass and catch. I'm still catching my breath. <laughs> Number 10 steps back to pass. He's looking for his man, and it's caught. He's inside the 10. What a huge time to lose the football. Yeah, you can't cough it up late in a tie ball game like this. If they end up losing because of that fumble, this poor guy is going to be looked at as the GOAT. They'll get the ball here at the 9-yard line. Start the drive at the 9-yard line. First and 10. Grambling State sets up in the eye. Hot. 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 Number 10 gives it up the middle. Brought down at the 15. They'll get six yards. Hot. Number 10 drops back to pass. Throws it out there. And it falls incomplete. And he misses his wide receiver there. Yeah, you're right. This is an area that he's worked so hard to improve since day one. The accuracy of his throws. He's improved, but as you can see, he's upset here with himself. Third down and four coming up on this one. Ball on their own 15. Number 10 with three wide receivers. Number 10, back to pass. He's under pressure. He throws it. Number five, hangs on to it. And they make the stop at the 20. First down, but not by much, guys. Boy, it was close, but a nice job by the receiver of getting enough yards for the first down. Set. Put hot. Put hot. Put hot. Put. Number 10, back to throw. Looks. He's going long. Swatted away. Coach, he made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. It's second down and 10 to go. Fifth play of this drive coming up. UCLA brings in the nickel here. Number 10 drops back. Let's it fly. Number 24 brings him down at the 33-yard line. And they'll go with a no huddle. Number 10 drops to throw. Let's it go. And it's knocked down. And the corner got in there and broke that one up. So it's second and 10. This is the seventh play of this drive. Grambling State comes out in the shotgun. Set. Put hot. Put hot. Put. Back to pass. He's in trouble. Complete. Number 22 with a takedown at midfield. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. First and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive. UCLA going with a three-man front. Number ten steps back to pass. He unloads it. Incomplete pass. Boy, would he like to have that one back. Yeah, you're right. This offense relies so much on timing, and as you saw there, when their timing gets knocked off, they have a tough time connecting on plays like this. So it's second and ten. Ninth play of this drive coming up. Number 33, alone in the backfield. Set. Put hot. Put hot. Put hot. 
Drops back to pass. He lets it go. Number 86 has it. Tackle at the 38. Grambling State calls a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. It's first and 10. 10th play of this drive coming up. They come out with four linebackers. Number 10 drops back to pass. Batted away. The wideout unable to catch that pass. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 38. Grambling State comes out with five receivers. He drops back. He passes it, and he's going to lose yards on this one. Six-yard setback. Back to pass. Looking under pressure. He's looking for his man. Incomplete. Well, he missed his receiver there, Coach. Yo, this kid needs to relax a little bit more. That ball's coming out 100 miles an hour. You can't expect the receivers to get to that one. Fourth down and a long ways to go. Ball on the 44. Number nine, back deep to return. They'll start this drive at the 14. UCLA comes out with two tight ends. Drops back to pass. Throws it out there. Number 18 with a catch. And he's taken down at the 49-yard line. UCLA takes a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. First and 10. Ball right around midfield. Number 27 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Number 10, back to pass. Under heavy pressure. And it's caught. And he's shoved out of bounds at the 45. That was a good completion there. Yeah, I really liked the good, clean routes they ran on that play. Second and four coming up here. Ball on the 45. Grambling State lines up in a dime defense here. He drops back. He gives a pump fake. Fires deep down the right side to the 20. And he's finally taken down at the 19. The offense calls a timeout. That was their second timeout. First and 10. They're inside the 20. They'll line it up for the field goal. The kick is up, and he got it. And that field goal is going to put him on top. Hey, Brad, you talk about clutch players? This kid is sensational. UCLA to kick this one off. Number five and number 33 back to return. Kicks it off. Number 33 fields it in the end zone. And this one's all wrapped up. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? I thought this one would be a blowout. UCLA escapes here with a win, but a close game like this one has got to hurt their confidence a lot. You better believe the next time they play against these guys, they won't take them so lightly. Well, that'll wrap up another chapter in NCAA Football 2003. And again, our final score, UCLA 17, Grambling 14. From all of us here at EA Sports, we hope to see you again soon. Goodbye, everybody.